It seems like a really interesting time right now in, in Canadian television. I mean, you look at kind of the global reach of shows like Degrassi and Fairness One Sketch and, and Pure and Orphan Black and Vikings. Is it getting better, easier to do what you do to tell the stories you're telling? I mean, if you're going to take Degrassi, we used to have seven days to shoot an episode. Mm -hmm. So now we're down to two and a half days per episode. And, uh, and. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. that must Are they two hour episodes? Oh, <laughs> half hour episodes, half hours. I, I don't minute. think he's signing on. Yeah, no, <laughs> no, no. And the truth is, this is crazy, it runs smoother than it ever did. Mm. And that has a lot to do with who you decide to hire as your crew and how they understand, and everyone's understanding of what's going on. Um, uh, is it more strenuous? Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy, but that's why we have rehearsal also. That actually works in for us in a big way. Mm -hmm. To have those two days of rehearsal, our kids come in and they're like, what do you want? Yeah. Ready to go. Yeah. You know, and so it's like they're already, that, that thing of going like, and we're not even talking about blocking or anything like that. Emotionally, that, that's two steps ahead of the game. Mm -hmm. yeah. But that had to come into place, I think, as a uh, as we were starting to run out of time on the floor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and so the days are bigger and thicker than ever, but it's like uh, we've had to make exceptions to um, get to the floor. And that means rehearsal time and as much prep as possible, you know, so. You know, I, ma I made a joke about the amount of time you have and, it's, uh, it's, uh, but I mean, and it has changed. I mean, there are certain shows like, uh, you know, Orphan Black went you know, nine, ten days, Vikings is 12 days, mm. plus some second unit, Anne's mm. 11 days. Yeah. On Pure, which is why I'm here, I mean, we shot six episodes in 48 days. Mm -hmm. um, and that was jammed. We had some big set pieces yeah. in there. Yeah. It was ridiculous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's weird how, you know, when I started out uh, years ago, you know, we were shooting, in Canadian television, you were shooting an episode in six and a half or seven days. And it's sort of expanded because there is a certain demand mm -hmm. on certain types of television, and it goes to the kind of television you're making. Mm -hmm. You know, um, uh, you know, Anne with an E is not Baroness von Sketch, mm -hmm. right? But uh, and it's at, not, nor, yeah, it's and not it's, television. And it's, and it's yeah. yeah, and it's not you know, and it's not Degrassi, and you know, uh, I don't know, uh, Game of Thrones isn't uh, Curb Your Enthusiasm. Mm -hmm. So it's all, you know, yeah. Yeah. to, no, to say everything should be this big massive yeah. thing, yeah. you know. I, I, there's something yeah, to be and said. I, I just want to say I've seen Game of Thrones face plant <laughs> and turn in a really substandard episode as many times as I've seen uh, Curb Your Enthusiasm yeah. do it. So yeah. No, there's anyway, something to be said about being under the gun. And, you know, yeah. I mean, oh. I, trust me, I like when I got some time. But it's, uh, there is something that comes from those scenes where we're like, what do you mean we've got 12 minutes? That's when you mm -hmm. find those creative so solutions. Yeah, yeah, there have been those occasions. So those, because I mean, when I did uh, United States back in the oh, 70s, mm -hmm. yeah. uh, uh, Larry Galbraith, United States with uh, Bo Bridges, we, it was single camera, no, uh, on a stage, you know, like a, a proper set, like, yeah. like the Ann set. <clears throat> Uh, but we rehearsed for three days and we shot mm -hmm. for two or two, two and a half and shot for two and a half, I can't remember, for a half hour and um, single camera yeah. and, and it was yeah. not, but we really rehearsed for two days. Sure, yeah. Like it was a proper rehearsal. No, I, I listen, I'm, I'm being complainy in the sense of like it would be nice to have more time but, but you know, you, you change with the times. I mean, we also have a studio that is incredible. We have a, you know, we have a full, the, that we do not have to transport. Let's just say that. It's all... Oh, you walk from pre-lit to pre-lit to pre-lit. Well, it's, uh, I mean, it's always, there's always a build going on, but there's also, we, our back lot is insane. Like, we and our, our designers are incredible. So we're not having to go downtown for a downtown scene anymore. Hmm. We don't have wow. that. Our, you have yeah, your own downtown? We have a York, we have a, uh, uh, our Yorkville that turns into an Eaton Center. It's all, ama it's an amazing, uh, mm -hmm. Stephen Stanley is an incredible uh, mm -hmm. art director and has done amazing stuff for us to make sure that's how we can do it, is that, our, that world, it's, it's always a, a pleasure to visit for people, I think, because they're like, it doesn't feel like a studio, it feels like a compound. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it feels like, you know, that you can have, it's a, very, a great, people have worked there for 10 to 15 years, like mm -hmm. they just never left. Mm -hmm. And uh, so the machine is in le at least in place for us to try to get all those fun things that we want to do. Mm -hmm. It's not always going to be the case, and you, you know, the first big thing that you want to do is the first thing that's get nipped in the bud. Yeah. But uh, um, yeah, I want more time on set. <laughs>